As teachers consider ways to document children's learning, they need to look at gathering evidence or samples of things that children have produced within the context of their own play or the learning environment. It's really important that teachers gather things that they can make comments about or comments on in relation to the children, the curriculum and their progress. As teachers plan processes for using and gathering evidence in folios, they really need to consider the roles that the different stakeholders have in interacting with the folio. For example, how children contribute to the folio beyond just photographs and commentary about them, and how we can meaningfully involve families in the use of folios, whether that's as a point of reflection or whether it's as a way of giving them the opportunity to talk about their child's own learning stories as well. The folio is a tremendous way to document the child's learning over time. So what it provides is an opportunity to gather evidence in an ongoing way about the child's learning as their learning progresses. So it, it gives you a, a tremendous insight into where the child was, for example, at the beginning of the year and where they get to by the end of the year and all the stopping points on the way through. So that length of time over which that assessment's been gathered makes it a really valid source of evidence about learning. And it also makes it tremendously reliable for teacher judgment making. Thank you.